has seriously been raining all week. Cold and yucky. I'm out here getting an estimate on my van. And it's just a uh, happy Wednesday, guys. This is ridiculous. Like literally every day this week it has rained. This is so ghetto. I don't even want to get out to go into work. Even though I have an umbrella. This is ridiculous. So it looks like they can fix my van, thank goodness. But I can't get it done for two weeks because they are all booked up. So he rigged it for me. <laughs> He cut off the piece that was hanging. The light thing, the wire, he said, looks like it goes to the fog light. So my headlights are still working, so it's fine. And then he got some new clips and clipped it back together. But he said he don't know if the sensor is messed up or if the pieces to the um, wire is messed up. So it's safe to drive until then. Because I, you know, I can get a rental car, but... I only when it's getting fixed, so I thug it out till then and hope nothing falls off. But he said I should be good. If not, I'm going back and I'm cussing him out. Um, went and got me some coffee. Actually, I got some breakfast. Um, but my coffee is not good. They didn't put the caramel in there, so now I got to put some sugar in it because it's not very tasty. Having an ice cream social at work. And they're giving us ice cream. Different kinds. I got moose tracks. I've never had moose tracks. Day after wind down Wednesday. Gotta get some coffee. Try this again to get my driver's license. Because now, I'm still riding dirty a whole month later. Don't y'all judge me. Hopefully I can use the kiosk. Look at this picture. I need to retake. I don't like that. Happy Friday. So I'm trying to hurry up and go back to the motor vehicle because yesterday I couldn't get my new license at the kiosk because apparently I used it before and they must have a one-time kiosk rule. So then I had to get a ticket and wait. But I was on my lunch break and after like 40 minutes I had to leave with not being called. I was like, why is so many people at the DMV? So I'm trying to look and see right when they open if it's going to be a lot of people there. This, I've never had this much issues with getting a driver's license renewed before. It's crazy. So we're going to try this one more time. Look at this. Look at all these cars. Oh my God. Okay, well, I don't think this is going to work. And I know there could be so many different reasons why people are coming to the motor vehicle. Maybe these is just employees. But also, look at the line. Hey guys. So, it's later in the afternoon, just a little bit. I am about to prepare myself for a ride. <laughs> I have to take this baby down state, which, you know, is a long ride, but has to be done. This is one of the, you'd be like, woo childs, but, you know, it's all for, gotta look at the, the greater good, right? So I'm gonna take this hour and a half ride both ways. So she can have a visit with her parents for the weekend. Um, I came on here to say that apparently we had an earthquake today. <laughs> um, get it, all these messages, and I see them jump on Facebook, of course, because that's how you find out all the news. You just go to Facebook, <laughs> and everybody's like from Jersey to Philly to New York, people feeling this earthquake. And I was like, my job must have the best building structure because I didn't feel nothing. And like nobody in my office, well, the people that sit near me, like none of us felt anything. Um, but apparently a lot of people did feel it. It was like a 4.8 or something. 
I don't know what's serious, but I know they just had an earthquake somewhere else in the world the other day. And um, like the building tipped over. I saw on TikTok. It's crazy. But you know, it's crazy though. Like it's been raining literally all week. Today is the only day since Sunday that it hasn't rained. And then now we have an earthquake. <laughs> then I believe the um, the solar eclipse is happening on Monday. So it's like, dang, we went from rain to earthquake. Now we about to have an eclipse. I almost feel like the world about to come to an end. They don't know when the rapture was supposed to happen, but did he tell us how he was coming back? <laughs> did he say what was going to happen? How were we going to be affected by it? Anyway, I'm off to do my work. Cold outside. Where is springtime? She tripping. I'm at the Wawa. Getting some gas. I got to fill up this work van on my way back to Newcastle County. I'm all the way down in Seaford. Um, had to, you know, do my weekly drop off. Um, I stopped at the Wawa to get some gas and a back home snack. It's gonna take me an hour and a half to get back to my job. And um, I got some pistachios. Let me know, what is your go-to like travel snack? I got some ice too, because I had some juice that was starting to warm up. So I wanna put it on some ice, but like, I think we talked about this before, but when you have a road trip, like what's your road trip snack? figure pistachios is easy for me to drive and eat <laughs> it's like can't make you can't make too much of a mess with pistachios